When you hear the word New Mexico and then education, usually the next word that comes to mind isn't leader. But Tamara Lopez spent the day at one school that's getting national recognition for their work with non-traditional learners. And I just said, you know, let me give it a shot and see if how it goes. That's what Beth Dorado said about entering her school for a chance to win a million dollars. She's the director at Gordon Bernal Charter School in Albuquerque. We still have a campus inside the Bernalillo County Metropolitan Detention Center. So we serve incarcerated adult students out at the county jail. And then we've had a variety of community campuses over the years with the intention that we meet individuals while they're incarcerated and then transition with them back into the community. And that million dollars? The Yaws Prize is a, um, a annual opportunity to earn money out of the Center for Education Reform and that's a nonprofit who helps support schools that are doing something different. Over 2,000 schools applied from across the country and 64 were chosen for the quarterfinals, including Gordon Burnell. We were so excited. All of us were excited about it. Just for being quarterfinalists, the school won $100,000. But for Ingrid Montoya, just helping students every day is reward enough. Here I am helping the students that uh, I was once one of them, you know, struggling to, to get my life situated and I met many people on the way. I have a lot of faith in this school. The school has about 400 adult and high school students, some of them in jail. And with the $100,000, Dorado says they hope to grow their programs. We're looking at career development programs. We're looking at increasing our behavioral and social supports. And long term, we would love to be attached to transitional housing for our students. Montoya says she can't wait to see what else the school does. Tamara Lopez, KOB4.